Pure White is a teeth whitening company uh, that was designed by a doctor, Dr. Dennis Hunt, who is a world-renowned periodontist, uh, research doctor at UCLA. He basically created a product that um, is safe for you to use for teeth whitening. It's a homeopathic teeth whitening over the counter, um, as well as their service. So you basically do it for an hour, and you can get anywhere from three to eight shades. It's a remarkable product that does amazing results, very safe, um, and little discomfort, if, if, if any. Uh, Rockstar White is going to be launched in two weeks, and it's an over-the-counter product that um, works the same. Um, homeopathic, safe, all safe ingredients um, to do your teeth whitening. No, no um, organic tissue damage. I mean, it's safe completely and it's a great product. It's like the more you whiten your teeth, the more you see your teeth get whiter. Um, but you, you get uh, only as natural as what the teeth you're born with. Yeah. Where is your website? Yes, our website is www.purewhiteonline.com. So I designed these shoes and we manufacture them in Los Angeles, California. They're all handmade with uh, U.S., mostly U.S. components, U.S. made components, and it's a bridal and evening wear, uh, and on the website you have the ability to go and pick any style you like and choose the colors you like, the heel height, the width, you can add crystals, you can take them away, do whatever you want. It's your day, it's your shoe, and it's your way. That's really the motto we're going with. And also trying to create jobs in the U.S., trying to bring back shoe manufacturing back in Los Angeles. So, Well, this shoe is handmade from scratch. Um, this is a satin insole, and uh, we use a special NASA-invented pour-on. It's, it's the special cushioning that remains soft even after four or five hours of wearing it. It has a memory that um, keeps your feet soft, just comfortable. And um, it's, it's pretty much all about comfort, not only style, but pure comfort. And you would have to walk in them to know what I mean, but it's just amazing to find comfortable shoes and be able to customize it to your preference, personalize it. And we also offer for our brides-to-be, we offer for them to write their names on their wedding dates inside the shoe as a memory. Uh, the crystals are all Swarovski crystals, they're all handset. This particular shoe has over 3,000 handset Swarovski crystals and um, this is all made by Swarovski crystallized Swarovski crystals. And what does something like that go for? This would, uh, this would cost about $590. Uh, our price ranges from 200 to 590. That is, this is the most expensive shoe we have. And uh, do you have a website as well? Yes, we do. We have a website, and the website is lanalia.com. It's L-A-N-A-L-I-A.com. Yes, flawless, new up-and-coming artist out of Jamaica, Queens, New York City. And I'm here in LA, first time ever showing LA love. They've been showing me love back. It's been great, man. Now, Flawless, is that a big name to live up to? I mean, yeah, it is. It was. It, it's not a self-given name. It's a name given to me by others. You know, I, when I was coming up, uh, you know, as a musician, like people always, always used to say, like you take you take time and you always put quality into what you do. You always want to make everything flawless. So that's how I got the name. So yeah, I mean, I gotta live up to it, you know. And if you listen to the music, you'll definitely understand. <laughs> right now, I'm working on a, a single deal. Um, new become an artist. My single is called Sunglasses. So make sure you look out for that. It's gonna be national radio everywhere very soon. What kind of music is it? Um, it's a mixture of hip hop and pop. So it's definitely going to bring something very international, you know? And are you going to the awards this weekend? Uh, yes, definitely. I'll be there. And I'm actually going to be performing at uh, the Key Club after Ray J's uh, after party. Nappy Roots will be performing also. So it should be a good look. Have you seen anything interesting at the gift suite today? Um, yeah, definitely. I just got here. I'm looking around. I see a lot of good things, a lot of interesting um, clothing by a lot of new, you know, designers. And um, yeah, a lot of, lot of nice stuff. Greedy Genius is here. They got a lot of, you know, nice uh, designs with their sneakers. So yeah. They're scrumptious, delicious, that's where we got the name from. Homemade, the day before, the order is done. This one is Pink Paradise. Tell me what it has in it. Pink Paradise is white chocolate dyed pink to match the company. Because it's pink, black, and white with the vanilla buttercream frosting. 
with sugar sprinkles on them to make them really look scrumptious and delicious. I have red velvet, the classic red velvet, which is everyone's favorite, with cream cheese frosting. It has chocolate chips inside, so it's super duper chocolatey. And the last one is cookies and cream. It has a cookie crust, white with crushed up Oreos and a vanilla buttercream sprinkle with crushed Oreos. Did you come up with all those recipes on your own? Well, yes and no. I love cookies and cream, so I found a recipe and I kind of twerked it to make it my own. So whereas one may have less, I'll add more Oreos and cookies, because like I said, that's my favorite, so I just take my favorite cakes as a child and make it my own. I mean, like when you think of cupcakes, most people just do vanilla, chocolate. I mean, is this a unique way to do them? Yeah, because vanilla and chocolate so boring. You know, I, I'm a happy-go-lucky person, and I think cupcakes should be fun, like me. Do you have a website where people can order them? I don't have a website. They can email me, or they can call me. And, and you will cater parties? Yes, cater parties, barbecues, anything. Where can we find you? What's your email? From Dilly at Hotmail.com. It's spelled S-C-R Street Level Clothing, we're doing well. It's been about two, two years since we've been out, and um, I love it. I'm getting a good response. Actually, Snoop Dogg wore the blue golf hat uh, on a video with him, Bruce, uh, Banner, and Little Wayne called 9mm, and uh, also Will I Am uh, rocked the red one uh, on some of his videos. Um, he actually wore a pin um, on one of his videos when he uh, was, was speaking side by side with Obama, and he had the golf pin on the lapel, so we're we're pretty hyped about that. It was a good look, you know what I mean, and we're just getting love.